On this photograph is a Japanese doctor, Fukushi Masaichi, holding a piece of legit human skin, which he took from a deceased person. This doctor had a weird line of work, and it is no surprise that many found it unsettling. Fukushi Masechi, who was born in 1878, always had a passion for medicine. After completing his studies at a Tokyo Imperial University of Medicine, he continued his education in Germany. He eventually created the Japanese Pathological Society, and his early studies concentrated on the effects of syphilis on thyroid disease. Masechi's realization that tattoo ink reversed the syphilis-related skin damage was a game-changer. The doctor then began to descend into a fairly gruesome rabbit hole. While employed at a Mitsui Memorial Hospital, a charity hospital in Tokyo, Dr. Fukushi gathered the skins for his collection. He would conduct the autopsy and save the skins of tattooed patients as they passed away from disease or old age in the hospital that served the poorer classes. In 1907, Masechi completely commenced his investigation into tattoos and met individuals who had a range of ink. His main focus was bodysuits, and for his studies, he paid individuals who agreed to contribute their dead skin. He used two different methods to preserve his hides, wet and dry. The skin was gently peeled away from the body. The nerves and tissues were scrapped off and then stretched out to dry. Masechi gathered 2,000 tattooed human pelts during the heights of his studies and documented them in excess of 3,000 times. However, during the bombing in 1945, a large portion of his collection was lost, and Masechi also lost more of his skins when traveling to America. He was reportedly traveling with them in a luggage, which was stolen in Chicago. There are currently just 105 left, and they are on display at the Medical Pathology Museum of Tokyo University. However, it is not open for public.